All right, you guys, um, before we get into this, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I just want to talk to y'all about something. Um, lately, I'm switching to coffee instead of doing pre-workouts because pre-workouts has about 10 times as much caffeine as coffee. And I do still want to have my caffeine before I work out, you know what I'm saying? But I do not need as much as I've been taking. I've been taking pre-workouts like twice a day sometime here and there. And that's not good. So thinking of my own health and coffee also has um, health benefits. But um, yeah, I'm be I've been using Javi coffee. Um, it's a convenient way to make your coffee. I mean, you could take it with you. You could have it at work instead of using the same coffee everybody else is using. You can have your own personal convenient coffee. You know what I'm saying? You can make any coffee you want, iced coffee or whatever. But comment, like, subscribe, share. Click the link, 15%. All right, YouTube, man, breaking news. I don't know if you already heard it by not or not, but uh, like the video before you get into this. But Mike Tyson just beat up some guy allegedly on the airplane. Um, crazy, crazy news, right? What happened, man? He lost his temper, punched passenger multiple times on a plane, on an airplane. Um, video shows Mike Tyson fights and pummels um repeatedly punches the man smiles and greets as he uh greets his fans as he left the plane wow hopefully mike don't get charges i don't know what happened um i'm not exactly sure but you know mike got big arms man he got them pythons not bigger than my arms though but um besides that man um i teach fitness my name is rapid time fitness uh, welcome to the channel. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Um, anybody who knows me already, already know what I'm about. Um, also, I've been talking about lately um, how I built my body naturally and teaching people the mindset, how to be safe, how to stay natural. Well, of course, how to stay natural. Just don't take the stuff. Um, you got to understand the dangers of bodybuilding bodybuilding is like the most dangerous sport um this last this is only the second quarter the beginning of the second quarter of the year and we lost countless people um to the sport um you got to think about your loved ones um also supplementation um caffeine um and other things um i take pre-workout but i'm going to start weaning my weaning myself off because I feel like I take it too much. Uh, Sometimes I might take it twice a day. And that's not good. I'm not perfect. You know, I show my flaws. I That's one thing about me. I'm not one of the people that's going to tell you I know everything. Because I don't. Nobody does. Um, I say that to say this. Um, my last video was me telling you how I'm going to wean myself off. Um, I think I'm going to go with coffee instead of doing pre-workout slowly but surely um i want to be pretty much coffee during my workouts um after this spring cut for the summer um lose weight for the summer get your six pack for the summer i teach that y'all see the physique you know what i'm saying it's right there in front of your face pythons bro you see them arms and stuff you know what i'm saying see the back you see the legs you see the um chest you see the biceps, you see the triceps, you know what I'm saying? You got to live your life like a lion, man. You got to be the king. I live my life more like a leopard, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm more solo dolo. But you see the arms, man. That's natural. Natty for life, bro. You see the abs. Natural. Natty for life. You see the back. Natural. 